Welcome everyone, thanks for joining us. On today's video, we're gonna show you how we replaced our RV headboard with our standard house one. My name is Z. And my name is Brandy. And, and we, we are Finding, finding Our Spots. We have a standard queen mattress in our motorhome. Our headboard was dated and covered in suede with not much cushioning. First, we measured the width and height. Then we removed the valances and the day-night shades. Prying the old headboard off the wall with minimal damage to the RV wall was the most difficult part. It was attached with three strips of double mounted tape, three screws at the bottom, and two globs of glue. Then came time for the dry fit. We found a box that was the perfect width of the mattress and used it to support the bottom of our headboard. We also made sure to do any painting in the bedroom before we installed the new headboard. We didn't want to get any paint on it. We found two hooks at the local hardware store to support the bottom of the headboard and then used the manufacturer's original screws and holes. We only had to drill two new holes in, in the bottom. We then used extra sturdy 3M double mounting tape for the top of the headboard where the wood is to ensure a good snug fit to the wall. And there you have it. Once we leaned it into the hooks and pushed it firmly up against the wall, it stuck. And here it is with the mattress installed. It was a perfect fit. I wouldn't have asked for anything better. And here's the bed dressed and comfy. If you like this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up or give us a thumbs down. If you have some feedback for us, leave it in the comments below. Subscribe to see some more video content. We have a few more videos we want to put out and let you guys know what we're doing to update our 2011 Newmar Canyon Star. So glad you could join us today. Have a great day. We'll see you next time.